Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Stellaris Megacorp is by and large corporation making subsidiaries since 2200 and indeed right now we are trying to force a subsidiary upon these guys right here the Absurin cartel right they they're they're criminals they are criminals they do things under the table no taxes no wherewithal for doing the right corporate thing we just cannot allow that to happen. So we have insulted the heck out of them. We tried to make them a proper subsidiary and offered to buy them out and all that, but no, they said no. So now we're in there with our warships and me and our sail ships, right? Um, <clears throat> anyway, and we are going to make a subsidiary out of them or at least some of them and leave it at that. Um, so when last we left off, we have made some progress in here. I do have the game paused because I want to go through this. And yeah, I'm, by the way, my name is Darwin. I play video games, if you haven't noticed. So uh, we are going to continue this war. We have our fleet of armies right here. I'm actually going to get them a general just because I think it's kind of cool. Um, not to mention, we have some titans in here. So let's see. Yeah, no. Uh, army upkeep minus 20. That's actually going to heal. Army morale and army damage. Uh, plus 5% army damage on the titans. Heck yeah! Let's do this! And you guys are going to come here and you are going to enter orbit because what do we have here? 310, 605. Yeah, I want you to face the titans. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, so... Wait, no. Hold on. What did I do? First fleet. Second fleet. What fleet are you? Oh, your seventh fleet. Seventh fleet is actually going to Sales Force One. That's why I see it. Alright, so we're gonna stay in Martum for a second. Now we can see a little bit in advance because of our sensors, and right here we have three rapid response flotillas that won't be that problematic to us i don't really know what they uh have for ships so hopefully hopefully our little uh coil guns and ship setups won't be you know obliterated but yeah that's a risky take right our war exhaustion is higher like i don't i don't get it like is it just attrition really that's getting it like why do we have is that just because they're not blowing up their ships? I never have had a good understanding of this system. So let's get you guys in there. Let's take over Mardom and that should like shoot things into our favor. Like I'd hate for this war to end because you know we just never got to engage them. Um, I was also worried before about the Zin Empire who were allied to the Atrian Cartel through a defensive pact. Like technically we're at war with them but uh, there's no way to get to us because they'd either to go through the Rebellion Star Nation, which they're not friends with, or the Interstellar Dis League, whom they're also not friends with. So Zinn really can't do anything to us. So we're going to just stomp on these guys. Uh, and Theory Raveners. The galaxy is not your personal garbage disposal unit, by and large corporation. Keep your so-called products to yourselves. Yeah, whatever. Um, your Raveners uh, will eventually take care of you. So... Can we land wow. our armies we yet? Really hit this tech out of the ballpark. Hydroponic farms, awesome. Naval capacity plus thirty. That is exactly. Oh, oh. Why do you have to do that to me, game? Wow. Chemical we bliss. Really hit this tech out right. of the Naval ballpark. capacity. What do we else do we get? We got researchers. Side of gas refineries. Yes, I'm gonna do that instead of destroyer or minerals. Um, Blast me in the comments if you want, but I really want... Oh, ho, ho! The Amoeba Juvenile that joined her fleet some time ago appears to have reached full maturity. Now an impressive adult, she is no less loyal to the ships that gave her a new home when she was stranded on Rupigar 1. Her time spent with the fleet appears to have encouraged adaptive behaviors not typically found in wild space amoebas, making her a more formidable presence on the battlefield than others of her kind. Across by and large corporation, her image has become something of a mascot for the butt... <laughs> Again, our typer, but in large, spirit. Only one question remains. What should we name her? Hey, before we go into naming her, 
if any of you know if I can like edit this somewhere for this playthrough, like let me know because this is just gonna cause me to crack up every time I see it, but I really would like to say by and large. And that's like a small end too. Like this is just, I don't know what I was thinking. It was bad. All right, so uh, Bubbles, Nyx, Renegade, Yuka, Saito, Boomer, Blaze, Nova. Okay, you know what? I I, I, I really like Battlestar Galactica and uh, so we're gonna call it Boomer. Sweet. So Boomer is now 471. She's going to join this fleet over here. And then eventually we'll have it go with uh, Mardon. Um, slow mover though, so it's going to take a while. 482 days to get there. Uh, yeah. Alright, so... we land our armies yet? No, land our armies. Let's do this. Growth and courage, order of bombardment, luxury is distributed. Oh, I'm paused. <laughs> I'm like, why is this not happening? Yeah, because you're Our paused, dummy. Just hit enemy soil running. Ooh. We're gonna need more troops. Oh my. Yeah, okay. Note to self. We need more troops. <laughs> enemy planet incorporated. Awesome. Revenue projections optimistic. Excellent. Excellent. So we have that planet. Um, what are we going to do? Uh, Oa Crike, you're going to recruit me some more armies. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That'll do for now. You can go back there. You. We can go there. Where are we at? 791. We need to be repaired, but let's try to get you up to good strength. Let's reinforce you. Our economy is doing so well. I'm a very happy camper here. Let's try to smash these guys down. Another bleeding edge technology discovered. We get barrier point defense. That's awesome. Uh, uh, what does auxiliary fire control do? Chance to hit plus five and uh, research station output. Let's do that. Like this whole like I'm 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 whooping them, and they're like, oh yeah. By the way. I don't really want to move them because the fleets that were in Octeria are pretty bad. And I'm betting that this is actually not that big of a star base. Really? Really? So might we have a chance? Okay, so we can get this the base trade protection. Yes. Construction complete. You, I actually want to go. No, I don't want to go there because they might send out their fleet. You, thirty-two days. And I want you to go there. And you guys, I think I might actually send over there. Really, like shooting fish in a barrel, stomping on insects, has never been so much fun. But, like, we're kicking butt, and yet it's us who's... <laughs> it's us who's, who's taking the most of the war exhaustion. I don't get it. Okay, so we're gonna come out here. Actually, a formidable, let's see, six, 15, that's actually larger than us. So let's see. We say, I'm gonna go passive, and we're gonna come here. Let's see if we can coax them out.
Can we coax him out? Maybe. If I sit over here, can I do this? Any way I can drag you out of here? You're gonna come and face me, guys? <laughs> oh. I just might have made a mistake. I just might have made a mistake, guys. Am I fighting? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. That might have been a mistake. ships jumping away. We can get rid of some of this other stuff. Yeah, okay. That was bad. to them. No. <sighs> huh. Push speed to 15. Federation. Oh, ow. Oh, we lost our raiders. Oh, I lost my raiders. Technology acquired. That's painful. That's very painful. Hmm. That's what I get, really, for uh, trying to be impressive. All for you guys. Did it for you. Did it for you. And look what happened. Um. Salesforce one is repaired. Can't afford to reinforce the fleet, but we are going to bring it out here. That's fine. But we do have... We're gonna go back to wherever we came from. So you're gonna go back to here. Because we're gonna have that tech in before too long. He was already at full strength. Am I already building that? Uh, yeah, we need... Hydroponics farms, and we'll do that. Earth. 
Another bleeding edge technology discovered. Serious industry, serious prime. Ah, uh, sure. That works. Second fleet, we need to merge. What am I doing here? 915. Me too. Get the pipe. Engineering research. Rare attack. Alpha Centauri, you're being taken care of. Owie world. Station under um, attack. Uh. Making more alloys. Just keep reinforcing. Fleet manager, didn't I turn this one? 15 of 20, yeah. Fleet is already at full strength. Oh, I must be at my Federation force limit. That's gotta be what it is. All right, 21 of 40. I forgot you're very slow. Incoming transmission. Let it go to voicemail. So if we agree to this. Does this mean that we get this? I think so. Okay. All right. You can go back. You can go back. Home base. I'm just gonna say soul for now. You can go back. Um. All right. All right, national preparedness. Science without borders, no, national preparedness. Boom. Yeah, you're not gonna be very happy with us. You, this research. Right, so we got this territory, so what we want to do, all right, let's see. Kapek Ro. I want to create a vassal. Um, actually, no, we're going to do This is going to be pack and go. Now, sectors. Rename this. Your pack and go. Create vessel. Pack and go. Vassal, awesome. Can I give them any more territory? Yeah, you're pathetic, that's fine. 
So if we go back to planets and sectors, we don't have them anymore. That's all right. I love it. Earth's ruled by a plant, dude. Um, pack and go, you're pretty pathetic. Can I give you... Uh, offer trade deal, transfer system. That's what I want to do. So, uh, Merga. Let's give you Merga. Take it. Excellent. Trade deal, migration treaty. All right. So that lowered us a bit, not too much. Complete. We might want to make the Owies a. Uh, we built something. Ah, oh, that trade value. Boom. We built something. That trade value. We just built all these, and we're gonna disband all those. Uh, following the period of growing support for the low citizenry, citizenry group, the Zen Empire is finally embracing the faction, adopting the core values. They are more authoritarian. All right, so we are going to leave it there. Uh, we have our first official subsidiary, which is Pack and Go Incorporated. Um, we won our first war, although it could have gone better. Um, I don't have claims on anything else. I should have done that. We have so much influence, but next time um, we'll do that. I'm still hoping to get wormhole technology and... Yeah, we're kind of hemmed in now. Um, there is a galactic market, but we really can't leave our local zone. There's like nowhere to go. We're blocked off here by the remnants. We're blocked up here by the raveners. Like there, there's nothing. So we're gonna focus inward a little bit. Um, I really wish we'd gotten a science ship out here somewhere, but that's all right. Once we get this wormhole open, it'll go somewhere, probably dangerous and full of ravenous bug, bug bladder beasts or something like that. And I have no idea why we can see in that system. Um, anyway, so yeah, I mean, maybe we'll do some more caravan coins. See if we can get something good there. Um, and we'll just continue to expand inward and try to do the best that we can. So if you've liked this video, please like it. If you like what we're doing here on this channel, please subscribe and spread the word. I cannot speak. I can't speak. But I will be doing better next time. So my name is Darwin. I play video games and I will see you on the flip side.